me right now versus me earlier. <laughs> <laughs> people okay so today I feel like I'm always in my car people are like this girl okay it is way too bright right now <laughs> give me a minute Ugh. better okay so today I am headed to Jonas's boot camp obviously if you follow me on Instagram or have watched any of these videos I probably name drop Jonas multiple times he is a soul cycle instructor, but today he's having um, like a body weight, like hit style boot camp at the Coconut Club. I think I just spit. Which is actually Adam Greenberg's new restaurant that's opening in DC. I have to pull my camera because I'm going over some bumps. Um, and Adam Greenberg was actually on Top Chef. Top Chef? Yes. Chopped. Chopped. Blech. He was on Chopped multiple times, and he was on Chopped All-Stars, and I'm pretty sure he won. Yeah, he definitely won. Anyways, we went to like an opening or like a like a preview party um, of the space like a while back, but Jonas is actually hosting his boot camp there today, which will be really fun. And I think like Sweet Greens, like sponsoring it, and Taylor Gourmet. Uh, I don't know if Taylor is like a East Coast thing or like a DMV thing, but it's basically like a really good sub place. Anyways, I am headed to that. It's been quite a morning. I missed um, class this morning. And we have Saturday morning practice on Saturdays, but we have a game today, so it was just a shoot around. So we were just gonna do like an hour shoot around, right? And my sister and I co-coach, but she couldn't be there today. Practice was at nine. Shoot around was at nine. My alarm didn't go off this morning. Thankfully, my body, uh, what is this car doing? I'm shocked actually that my body woke me up because I went to bed super late. My, I woke up at 8.40 and I was like, oh my God, because I had to leave my house at like 8.45. So I was like, shit. I literally like jumped immediately out of bed, like put on my clothes, brushed my teeth and left my house. Only for us to start practice 20 minutes late because the custodian forgot her badge at home so she had to run home and get it so we couldn't start practice till like 9 20. i was so mad it was supposed to end at 10 so i started telling parents like oh 10 15 like come pick them up and this was literally so i could like make it to soul cycle at 11 45. but i had to run home first because i didn't bring myself because i thought we were gonna end at 10. so long story short did not have time to make his class so i was pissed about that and then i was like i'm not even going to the boot camp like i'm so freaking grumpy right now but I decided to be a good friend because I need to support. Like, I do daily vlogs and it's like this is literally the day of my life, being in the car for a fucking hour. Because everything I do is in DC these days. A lot of people, like, that I'm, like, when I talk about Soul Cycle, they're like, why don't you just, like, cycle on Frederick? And I'm like, oh my god, you don't understand. Long story short, that's why I'm traveling so much because all of the boutique fitness, all of the cool stuff, that's in cities. I don't live in a city, as you know. I live in Farmville, USA. Not literal Farmville, but I mean like I definitely live in a farm a rural town and like the city that I technically live in, like the county, city, whatever, um, it's not a city like. We have a downtown, but it's not like the city. Visit Frederick, Maryland, and you'll know what I'm talking about. Look who I'm with! Hello! Hey, that's a good one.
person. It's like really scary. Fuck waters. This is like this is like me right now versus me earlier. <laughs> Okay guys, so just finished up Jonas's boot camp. I should have filmed myself like directly after camp, but it was like kind of overwhelming. I was so sweaty. It was definitely hard, but it was so, it was literally so fun. Like there were so many fun people there and just everyone was having a good time, just supporting each other. And it was just like so fun. It's so interesting for me to see like Jonas outside of a soul cycle setting or like seeing a lot of the people there obviously be people who take soul cycle and just doing like a totally different workout. So I'm like so proud of him for doing this. This is his second boot camp and he has his third one literally in like four days. Um, but it was so fun. Like it was just such a good time and just like such good energy, like so many good people. Um, I was working out next to Kimia, who's like one of my like best friends through Seoul, like just so crazy. And then next to Sunny, who Sunny's an instructor. Sunny was like definitely pushing me because girlfriend was killing it. And I was like, oh shit, like I have got to keep up. But it was just super fun, um, just a really fun day. So now I'm heading home and I have a basketball game tonight. Literally, it never ends, but hopefully we go. It's a super late game on a Saturday night for like middle school girls, but hopefully we go, we get the dub and yeah. So super excited. Uh, I, I feel really good, that was really fun, but I'm definitely gonna have to stretch tonight. And I was wrong in the first video, not the first video, but on my way down, I thought it was Sweet Green and Taylor, which made no sense because that's two food things. So it was Taylor Gourmet and then it was Drink Juicery, which has like a bunch of like awesome good drinks. And then they had like mimosas and it was just such a good time. Like the workout itself was hard. Like I was sweating buckets, but it was just like, it was just fun. It was, it was a good time. So yeah, I, I keep saying the same shit. So I'm gonna get off of here now. I'll be home in an hour. Time to listen to some podcast.